Designer Catherine Montague thought that she'd arrived at her destination in the domain of high fashion. But this wasn't quite what the universe wanted. It was only after opening her own boutique that she discovered her true niche and Michelle went to see exactly where she fits in. Josie and Cape Town may think that they're the South Census of South Africa, but Durban is quietly eating their lunch. It's a greenie based designer, Catherine Montague is serving up a feast of style, including exquisite bridal fashion, sexy cocktails in the city, and red carpet knockouts. She's created a highly respected personal brand, but her career has also taken her along the roller coaster path of the local clothing industry and her independence has been hard won. When the who's who of Durban celebrities and socialites want to glam up, they turn to sought-after fashion designer Catherine Montague. She'll be jetting off to Europe shortly to showcase her latest bridal collection and we get him an exclusive sneak peek. Catherine was busy with a fitting when Michelle arrived. Hello ladies, how are you doing? Good, and you? I've caught you in action. Yes. What was the brief that you received from the client? Rianne's going to a wedding, and she wants to show off this beautiful body she's been working so hard on. So we put some ideas together, sketches, and this is what we kind of came up with. I think you look spectacular. How do you feel? I feel elegant, I feel classy, and I feel absolutely sexy. Isn't that the most awesome feeling, hearing that feedback? My job's done. Well, please let me not keep you. I'll chat with you after. Yes. Catherine has taken the design sketch to a new level with mixed media on canvas. Sorry to keep you waiting. Not at all. I've been admiring this artwork. Is it yours? Yes, it is. For my bridal gowns, my clients will commission me to do a canvas painting because when their gown has been worn, it's put away. So what better way to show off your gown with just hints of the fabrics and the embellishments? You've been fortunate enough to travel the world through your work. Why do you believe travel is so important? When you're in Durban, you think, wow, I'm great at what I do. But when you travel overseas, you see how small Durban really is. And your mind somehow, you're able to stretch your mind and want to do more, want to do better than what you're actually doing. So the traveling is great and I would tell any designer, go out there, get a feel for what's happening and bring it back here. You'll be jetting off to Europe shortly to showcase your latest collection. We'd love to see some of your work. Come, let's go. Catherine completed a diploma before joining a clothing manufacturer as an in-house designer. This enabled her to expand her knowledge of every aspect of the industry. But when boom turned to bust, she had to fend for herself. Her independent career started off with corporate work and soon she added smart casual and couture to her repertoire. So Michelle, this is where the magic happens. As a fashion designer, creativity comes to you naturally. But you're also a businesswoman. How do you balance the two? It was tough initially and I've had to learn through making a lot of mistakes. But you know, I have such an amazing husband and I have little children. And they allow me my freedom to travel, to do what I need to do as far as expanding the business, growing the brand. And I have such an amazing staff. Where do you see the Catherine Montague brand in the next five years? I'd love to make South Africa proud and let our international countries know that South Africa can be on the map to showcase beautiful clothing. They say that clothes maketh the man. So it's only fitting then that you'd always want to look your best. And when you do, you know you can count on Catherine Montague.